All right, so I'll open up Adobe Photoshop Mix and come up to add a, create a new project. Do a custom canvas, and I'm just going to do it. Um, just done a couple here, but I'm going to do a width of a thousand pixels and a height of six thousand pixels, because what we're after here is a. Um, tall thin strip and what's really nice about this is that it looks super good on Pinterest I got a Pinterest strip and maybe you've sometimes seen those longer strips they kind of stand out so it can be a marketing tool to gain attention to um, your work and your creations all right let me just double check the focus here okay so I'm going, I've put my five images in an album. So I'll start off. And even though I've made this a thousand pixels by 6,000, um, it just seems like it wants to resize the canvas. And it's given me the size that I put in there. So we're just going to roll with it. But I'll bring that up to the top. Oh, I want to make sure it fits in there. Up to the top of my strip. And I can zoom in a little to see what I'm doing here. Okay. And so maybe I'll go with more of a close-up. I had my giraffe shot. And I can just keep adding images. Um, maybe my texture and abstraction. Okay, just keep adding to go up to my five, my ant view. So I brought in that, make sure this portrait one fits in there as well. And then finally I'll bring in my last image. All right, and just bring that down. Okay, so I'm just going to zoom in to make sure that it's just image to image to image, that there's no white on the edges or white in between the photos. And I, I just really love this project because I feel like it, the sum becomes greater than the parts. Now, there's some extra room down here. And if I had more verticals, it might have been full, um, filled in. But when you've added your five images, you can just come up right here to the crop tool and make sure that when you're cropping it because we just want to pull this up from the bottom try not to get the bigger dots on the edges because we don't want to affect the side to side just want to get it right in the middle and pull that up there uh, Oops. there we go and then when you're done cropping you can just click that little plus right there and then your oh look at that got a little strip down there at the bottom don't want that so I'm gonna go back to my crop tool just come up a little bit all right good that looks nice and clean all right and then I can just you know save it to my camera roll and then pin it all right there you go